You traveled some distance to reach Haven. You're from the Circle in Ostwick? I was. It's exciting, being away from that life, being somewhere new. Maybe that's selfish, given what's happened. No, it's only fair, I suppose. We are grateful for your assistance. You're from the Circle in Ostwick? I spent the better part of my life there. It feels strange to be away. It does, at times. I'm still getting used to it myself. It's been... interesting. I'm sorry. The Circle isn't the most pleasant topic of conversation right now. Or ever. Shall we speak of something else? You're from the Circle in Ostwick? Would you prefer I stayed locked away like a good mage? I didn't... I only meant to make conversation. A poor choice of topic, given our past. You're from the Circle in Ostwick? In light of what's happened, does it matter? I did not mean to pry. Was there something else you wished to discuss? The mages are ready to approach the breach. I pray this will be enough to close it. You weren't happy with how I brought in the mages. Do you have a problem with me as well? Of course not. <sighs> I have no intention of endangering your alliance, but I must ensure the safety of those here. That concern extends to the mages. They are putting themselves at risk for the Inquisition, as are you. Any precautions taken are meant to aid you, nothing more. I hope you will accept them as such. I know how I spent my time in the Circle. But what was a typical day for a Templar? <laughs> typical? The last time I was in a Circle was right before it fell apart. Nothing was typical. Before that, then? Certain rituals require a full guard. A mage's howling, for instance. I've attended a few. Most of the time, you merely maintain a presence, on patrol or in the circle, ready to respond if needed. Mages pretend to ignore that presence, but they're watching you just as closely. We would spend all day with Templars, and yet they rarely spoke to us. A habit often mistaken for coldness, I'm sure. But we are expected to keep a certain distance from our charges. If a mage is possessed or uses blood magic, you must act quickly, without hesitation. Your judgment cannot be clouded. Of course, ignoring one another does nothing to foster understanding. First the Templars, now the Grey Wardens. Both devoted their lives to fighting evil. Now they serve it. If I was possessed by a demon, would you? I would rather not consider it. 